Blockchain is the second era of the internet. And it turns out the most important technology for the next few decades is not artificial intelligence or autonomous vehicles or um, the internet of things or robots or drones. It's the underlying technology of cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin. Not Bitcoin, but the technology that makes that work is the internet of value. And what that means is that when I send you some information with the first era of the internet, I'm sending you a copy. A PDF, a PowerPoint, an email, even with a website, I keep the original. But when it comes to things of value, assets, like money, stocks, bonds, art, music, intellectual property, um, votes, Sending a copy is a terrible idea. We don't want to vote twice. We don't want to copy money. If I send you $100, it's really important I don't still have the money. So we've had no communication medium for value. And that's what blockchain is. It enables people everywhere to trust each other, to exchange things of value from money to votes to music to do that in a way that's secure and confidential. And this will bring about profound changes to every institution in society and to all of our lives, personally. You should care about that if you're a musician and you think that you should be fairly compensated for the art that you create. You should care about that if you're an owner of land because we now have a platform whereby land titles can be secure. You should care about that if you consume electricity because with blockchains, we're going to have a distributed power grid that will be green and where you, from your solar panel, can sell power to your neighbor for money. Uh, you should care about that if you're a citizen because blockchains will enable much more open and transparent governments. Uh, you should care about that if you're a business person because, or an entrepreneur because little companies will be able to have all of the capabilities of big companies without all the main problems, old cultures and, and legacy systems uh, and so on. So overall, this will affect every nook and cranny of society and affect all of our lives very profoundly.